There are so many health benefits for a sauna and after doing sauna regularly, very regularly for the last 25 years, I would like to share with you my favorite 12 benefits for a dry sauna like this. So the first one is that it's supposed to release the stress. And for me, that's the one of the main reasons to do that. I'm working very hard. I'm in, I'm, I like to work very hard. I like to work intensely. But when I need to de-stress, then this is my favorite place. I just have a chance to lay down, to relax, not to have to think about anything, to let my body do the work. And, uh, and just laying or sitting in a sauna, uh, sweating away, letting the stress melt away from my muscles, from my cells. It's a wonderful, uh, wonderful health benefit for the sauna. That's number one. The second health benefit for the sauna is that it's induced a much deeper sleep, at least for me, but I, I heard that from so many people, is that uh, after a sauna, especially when I'm doing the sauna in the evening, which that's how I like to do that, I'm going to bed and I'm asleep within seconds. So I guess that it just relaxes everything in the body. The muscles are relaxed. The mind for sure is relaxed. That's benefit number one. And then when I go to sleep, I drift very quickly into a, a deep sleep. And uh, yeah, there were periods in my life that I didn't sleep so well. Sauna was always my uh, best uh, sleep pill, sleeping pill. A third benefit of the sauna is that it flushes toxins from your body. And uh, that's especially true if you do it in the right temperature range. I used for many years to go to very, very hot sauna, 90 degrees Celsius, 100 degrees Celsius, and they're very, very hot and they're pretty aggressive on your body. But what happens then is that the skin is kind of uh, close off the pores and you sweat differently then. And uh, while if you're keeping it to a lower temperature, like between 60 to 70 uh, degrees Celsius, then, uh, then most of the toxins can go out uh, through the skin. And it's a fantastic way to just do a regular cleansing of your body from toxins. So, uh, and I'm, I'm talking very regular. Yeah. The fourth health benefit of a sauna is uh, recovery from uh, from workout, especially when you're doing something intense. If, if you went to the gym, that's why in many gyms there are saunas there, and that's very very good to use immediately after the gym, uh, or uh, when I'm uh, when I'm running or when I'm doing a, a rock climbing or some intense physical activity. Then the sauna is uh, is. For me, it's the best way to relax my muscles, is to uh, relieve the joint pains or muscle pains. And uh, I can also stretch uh, much better in the sauna. My body is, is warm and, uh, and, and, and relaxed. So uh, it's, it's, it's just a fantastic way to just release all this tension from your muscles and uh, allow your body to recover a lot faster. Fifth benefit of the sauna is it improves your cardiovascular uh, performance. So your heart is getting stronger and it can handle uh, more stress, especially in combination with the heat of the sauna and uh, going for a cold shower or cold bath immediately after the sauna, then coming back to the heat. So this temperature difference is also very, very strong. Sixth health benefit of the sauna is that it's uh, it helps uh, fight illnesses, either to prevent them. So I like when I am start just start feeling that I'm going to get a cold or I'm getting a sore throat or something like that. I will just go to the sauna, put it quite high and uh, somehow miraculously or wrong, miraculously, I'm sure that there's a simple explanation for that but I, the, the illness doesn't evolve further than that for most cases but it also helps fight uh, certain illnesses again I'm not a doctor I'm not a medical profession but if you google it a little bit you'll find out that there's a lot of recommendation for certain illnesses to actually use the sauna use the uh, increasing the body heat in order to fight uh, certain illnesses so it's a um, it's it's actually a very natural and very healthy um, illness fighter if you want the seventh health benefit of a sauna is that it cleans your skin through the sweat. It takes all the dirt, all the dead, dead cells are coming out. And uh, with combination with the dry or even wet uh, brushing of your skin, then you're getting rid of the dirt and, and some toxins and, uh, and especially dead, uh, dead cells and just have your skin glowing soft and uh, the next health benefit of a sauna is something that I cannot, um, I, I, I didn't experience it yet, but uh, there is this research that was done over many, many, many years, over thousands of people in, uh, in uh, Scandinavia that actually proven very strongly the connection between Alzheimer and sauna. And when you're using sauna regularly, and I'm talking very regular, three, four, five times a week, you actually can reduce the chances for Alzheimer and dementia by 65%. And since for me, dementia is, it's comes in the family and genes and everything, it's very very important for me to avoid that then uh, that will that that is one of my main reasons to uh, do sauna regularly can't prove yet if it works or not I think I remember what I ate yesterday 
but uh, let's see if I can still remember that 20 years from now. But uh, yeah, that's uh, that's major and that's proven in uh, in uh, quite a few researches. So that's uh, that's a good reason for me, good enough by itself to just do a lot of sauna. I don't know if it's health benefit, but the ninth benefit of a sauna for many people is that it improves their body image. Uh, the way that we are doing it uh, in uh, in when I learned how to do the sauna which was in the Netherlands but it's done this way more in Germany and in Scandinavia so in this area of the world we the way that we do sauna it's uh, it's always men and women mixed and it's always naked uh, actually you cannot go into the into those saunas with the bathing suit because it's considered um, unhygienic so uh, at the beginning for for me at least coming from Israel I wasn't used to that so it was uh, it was quite confronting to be naked in front of other people men women different different people but at one point you start realizing that we all have a body and nobody, no body is perfect. So there are old people and young people and fat people and skinny people and tall people and, and short people and uh, people with, without limbs and people without breasts. And, and, and at one point you just learn to accept it that we are not perfect, you don't need to be perfect. And it's a, it's a wonderful, wonderful uh, uh, way to learn to love and appreciate and accept your body as it is. And uh, I, I know that for many, many people, that's is a major. Uh, it's also very confronting, so it might not fit you. But uh, for many, many people, that's a way to improve their body image just by going regularly to a sauna with other people when it's mixed, when it's nude sauna. If uh, that works for you, go for it. If you prefer it differently, you know, in most of the world, they are wrapping themselves with uh, towels and, uh, and uh, sometimes it's just men and women separate. The tenth uh, benefit of a sauna for me is that it's a place to meditate. It's a very quiet place. Uh, when I go to a spa, when there are different types of uh, saunas, I will usually choose for the quiet sauna, for the meditative sauna, for the silent sauna every time it's called differently. But the point is that it's a sauna that you're not allowed to talk, so everybody's in their own space. And I think that the combination of the heat, the sweating, the, the relaxation of the body, uh, sometimes it's the smells and the scents and the, um, the, the herbs that they are putting on the, on the, on the stove are promoting uh, introspection, they are promoting uh, going into an altered state of consciousness. For me, this is a very, very easy space to get into a deep meditation. On the other hand, so that's number 11 uh, of benefit of a sauna, is that it can be a very, very social place. Uh, again, where I learned to enjoy sauna, that was in the Netherlands, and that's a, that's a pastime for families, for friends, uh, people going together with each other, either either with their family members, their kids, their, their partners, or their uh, friends to the sauna for an evening together or a whole day together. And that's a chance to get closer and to communicate much more intimately because in the sound, even in the saunas that are not silent, then you're, you're kind of coming closer to each other, you more whisper, uh, the conversations are sometimes more intimate. So it's a chance to get together. Uh, we used to uh, do our uh, company meetings uh, in the sauna because it brought some closeness uh, that that allowed uh, for for more uh, more connection more team building so this is this is a way to connect so i usually if i will go with with Vered or with a friend to the sauna i will use some saunas i will uh, do them uh, on my own in the meditative space and some of them just to connect and uh, and be intimate with each other so that's uh, that's health benefit number 11 and the last one number 12 is sauna is just fun i just enjoy going to the sauna the, the, all those benefits are more in my mind but when i'm there I'm just feeling good about myself, I'm feeling good being, I'm relaxing, I'm going after that to sleep and I'm sleeping fantastically. So it's just something that uh, to finish the day with that, that's, uh, for me, that's a, that's a fantastic uh, way to enjoy life. Uh, I'm, depends on the season of the year and depends on how busy I am, but I would try to get to the sauna three, four, five times a week. And uh, sometimes I manage and sometimes I don't, but uh, I wouldn't miss that for the world. So that's my 12th uh, health benefit from the sauna. First of all, as a, as a disclaimer, I'm not a doctor, I'm not a medical professional. Uh, sauna is something that you need to discuss with your, uh, with your uh, health pr practitioner if you have any issue that might uh, prevent you from doing it. So, you know, it's on your own risk. For me, it's good. Those are my uh, 12 health benefits of the sauna, but you need to make sure that uh, it's good for you too. If you have any other experiences with the sauna, please let me know in the comment box below. And until we meet again, Live fully, stay awesome from Nissan.